predictions were right. And I'm kind of upset about it. survive if they're all skinny boys, but not if they're all big boys. So many I Robots! Well, now I have to fight him. I bet you yell at him. Put him up, then put him down! Oh, your jackdaws flown, Edward. Eh? That's the beauty of a democracy. The many outvote the one. Oh, you could sail with me, but with a temper as hot as yours, I fear you'd burn us all to cinders. Luckily, I know the king's bounty on your head is a large one, and I intend to collect. Have you, uh, have you ever seen the inside of a Jamaican prison boy? Jackdaw's gone. Then I can't sail anymore. Oh, oh, we're back in the. We snapped back to reality. This isn't where my office is. Where am I? Hello? How are you? If you're anxious, that'll pass. It's the Medazolum. I'm sorry about this. But we've had so many security breaches, we were forced to take drastic action. And Olivier is missing. He left for Chicago two days ago, but no one's seen him since. I know this seems excessive, but with our high-level security clearance, we have an obligation to our shareholders. Rest assured, we will compensate you when hacker is found. So get some rest, okay? And, if you're up to it, maybe capture some more footage? You're doing amazing work. I can't wait to show you the work we've been doing with your stuff. Take care. <laughs> so, they tossed you in the bunker. Nice. Those Templars upstairs aren't taking any chances. I think... We need to erase all the dirt they might have on you. Did you hear that? <laughs> I think I just gave you level 3 security clearance! Now, head to the security room and use the cameras to watch the door to the server phone. Unfortunately, Melanie's in there now. So when I escort her out, that's when you make your move. I'd wipe these servers myself, but as the head of IT, I'd be a suspect. It has to be someone they've already locked up. Ah, oh, these Templars. They run our lives, you know. Ah, uh, they decide elections. They, uh, 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 hey, you know you're supposed to be locked up, right? Going back upstairs ain't a good plan. Oh, 
by the Wi-Fi now. my face up against this knows a lot of bounds. internal context video. Oh, what is this? The dawn of the deadly 18th century. Rogues and sailors band together to live their lives by the sword. 
with no laws or morals, no gods, and no fear. Only betrayal, mutiny, cruelty, and debauchery. There is plunder to be found on golden beaches. Will you risk life and soul to fight the pirates of nightmares? Benjamin Hornigold, Calico Jack, Charles Bain, and Blackbeard? Pirates of nightmares. Can a video game out of this? pushed all doubt aside. <sighs> we bless poor Desmond, who gave his life so that you, the children of our labors, would live on to fulfill your purpose in ours, in mine. But now is not the time. My strength is not sufficient to inhabit an organic vessel. There is more work to do, more samples to acquire, more artifacts to find before my will can attain. What's happening? Tell me! Make me whole again, my children, my instruments. Bring me forth to fulfill your purpose. Tell me! No, no, no! Something's wrong! God damn it! be here, now, living in that goddamned head of yours. Fuck, 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 fuck. Why did she spare you? Why are you still here? You have a nice little chat about how you apparent, apparently tried to sizzle my fizzling brain out. Majesty's court contends that the defendants, Mary Reed and Anne Bonney, did piratically, feloniously, and in an hostile manner attack, engage, and take seven certain fishing boats. Secondly, this court contends that the defendants lurked upon the high seas and did set upon, shoot at, and take to certain merchant sloops, thus putting the captains and their crews in corporeal fear of their lives. Edward James Kenway born of motley parentage in Swansea, to an English father and Welsh mother, married at 18 to Miss Caroline Scott, now estranged. She's a beautiful woman, I am told, but not at all well these days. If you touch her, you bastards, I'll... Quite a surprise finding you here rotting in a Jamaican prison. We heard rumors that you had taken up with the pirate Roberts. If you know the observatory's location, tell us now, and you'll be out of here in a flash. Rogers can hold these British hounds at bay, for a time. But this will be your fate if you fail to cooperate. You 
Mary Reed and Anne Bonny are to go from hence to the place from whence you came, and from thence to the place of execution, where you shall be severally hanged by the neck, till you are severally dead, dead, dead. Oh, Ross. May God in his infinite mercy be merciful to each of your souls. We're pregnant. Do you all hear that? What the devil did she say? They plead their bellies, my lord. You can't hang a woman quick with child, can ye? Quiet! Quiet! If what you claim is true, then your executions will be stayed. But only until your terms are up. Then I'll be up the duff the next time you come knocking. Remove them! What's your name? Philip, Ken Moore, Conway. Miss Walpole, ain't it? Walpole? Where'd you get that? Well, that's the rumor going round. As dirty and daft a pirate as ever sailed these West Indies. Well, whatever his name, gotta make sure he suffers without dying. Orders from the governor. And back to the prisons at sundown. And massage his feet if he's aching, shall I? Boy. Quiet, water. you! Water. I just drank a bottle of water. Stop! Ah! Oi! You stop that! Ah! Oi! Stop that! Ah! Oi! You stop that! Good morning, Captain Kenway. I have a gift for you. Do not mistake my purpose here. I have come for Anne and Mary, oh, hey. and you owe me nothing for this. But if you would lend me your aid, I can promise you safe passage from this place. I'll need weapons. You are comfortable with this, I am told. We must hurry. Why, thank you. Hold on. 